big employer in Brevard County is announcing layoffs. L3 Harris has thousands on its workforce in the county, but it's still unclear what the actual impact there could be. Our Brevard Bureau Chief Scott Heidler has the official word from the company and an economist's take. Calling it a move to right-size its workforce, aerospace and defense powerhouse L3 Harris is announcing layoffs. The company is Brevard County's third largest employer with over 7,000 workers in the county. The global company is headquartered in Melbourne. An official at L3 Harris sent West to a statement on the layoffs. It reads, in part, L3 Harris continues to focus on operational performance and delivering on our LHX Next commitments, including $1 billion in gross cost savings over the next three years. With this in mind, and having identified a series of opportunities to streamline our operations, we have made the difficult decision to right-size our workforce. The company has not released any numbers or details of the layoffs, so the impact, if any, here in Brevard County is uncertain. You know, this could be anticipate, you know, an anticipation of, uh, you know, tighter defense budgets uh, in upcoming years. Uh, you know, it could be, again, just a, you know, sort of a, uh, as you said, streamlining or, or a, a cost uh, um, shifting. Cost reduction could be coming from a shift in the global defense industry, where there's more of a focus on drones and away from big defense systems. The companies, if they want to remain at the forefront, they... They do have to be nimble. They can't wait to react until after the markets change. So it's yet to be revealed if and how this potential reaction to the market will impact the L3 Harris employees in Brevard County. In Melbourne, Scott Heidler, West 2 News.